Former Viking, former Gopher, keeps tabs on his teams, but this fall he's got a sports job keeping him busy. And that's not usually the case. Faribault High School grad Mark Dusbabic is about to take part in his favorite week. It's just going to happen a little bit later than years past. Marcus Bobby came to the Vikings from the Houston Oilers. He remembers it well. Scott Studwell, right away, the first day I signed, I went in to work out, didn't know anybody, and Scott Studwell met me in the, in the, in the weight room and told me to come up every day at, at 7.30 in the morning, and this is where he'll be there. And he kind of took me under his wing and showed me a lot. He played next to Hall of Famer Chris Dolman who lost a battle with cancer earlier this year. In fact, I got a chance to see Chris probably around four or five years ago in Atlanta when I was doing the tour championship and he came over to the, uh, the Golf Channel booth and we sat and chatted for a while and reminisced and you know, I, I miss him, he was a great player. He mentions golf because that's become his second sports vocation. A rules judge on the PGA Tour. Like football, they keep playing without fans. What is it like to work the PGA Tour without fans? Probably easier for you, huh? It's so much easier for me from a refereeing standpoint. Um, I don't have to worry about so many uh, rulings because of the uh, there's no structures built for the corporate hospitality. Um, balls are going into places that uh, normally you might get relief for, for for spectator damage. It did get a little difficult at the PGA Championship when he ended up with ample airtime because of a ruling involving Rory McIlroy. But yeah, that was that was. Uh, that was fun. It was fun to work at. Rory uh, couldn't be a more professional guy. And um, when I had the ruling with him, I, you know, I asked him, are you comfortable with this? And, and when he turned to me and said, no, I'm really not comfortable with it. And that just shows a lot about his character and a lot of the character of the, of the other professionals on the PGA Tour. And soon he will work again. His 14th time at the Masters has been delayed, but it always is the most special. No doubt, no doubt. They, they do an excellent job there. They're, they're so precise in all their, in all their levels of, of putting on a golf tournament. Um, hey, I'm just a guest in, in my first couple of years there. It felt really awkward and um, I felt like I was always being watched and maybe I was, I don't know, but um, I feel very comfortable there now. It feels so strange to say this in November. Norman, yeah. but the Masters will air right here on Channel 4 <laughs> next weekend. Yeah.